somebody says, why did you even bother to shuffle the cards? I'm like, well, I don't always just choose the first deck. Awesome. You are getting on, getting on, Sagittarius. You are moving on, letting go, or back to something that is a stable relationship that makes you really happy. Okay. Central card, central theme, three of wands for your love life. Okay. Committed bonds, single, dating, trying to get an ex back, whatever. For your love life. Sagittarius, you have done everything you can do, okay? The ball is in their court, all right? The ball is in their court. There has been hurt, okay? But it quickly, it's almost as if they realize and they, it's like, it's almost as if they didn't feel connected to you or they kind of lost sight of what the goal was with your relationship. And you just threw your hands up and said, hey, buddy, this is on you. I'm fine. Okay, you need to figure this out. And it hurt. It may have hurt them. It may have hurt you. But it's almost as if there's this quick recognition, like fire signs do. And I'm not saying that they, they're a fire sign. But it's almost as if there was on their part, Okay, because you remember, you've done everything that you can do. Even if you feel disconnected from yourself, you're you can get back to that easily, but they can too. All right. So even if there was hurt, even if this there was the end of some sort of cycle, a huge fight or, or breakup, it they it's almost as if they quickly recognized what was going on and recognize that they didn't want that type of ending. They actually wanted this with you, okay? Celebration, marriage, attending a wedding, all right, happiness, stability. And it's a, as if they just got this moment of clarity and then all of a sudden, you're happy. Your relationship is good. It's stable, okay? Very well may be with an earth sign. Okay, Could be another fire sign too, because fire signs are like, oh crap, I totally messed up. I did not mean to say that. And I genuinely mean it. You know, not in some sort of weird narcissistic way, just to come back and manipulate you. They actually genuinely were like, crap, I messed up. Okay. Now, very possible it's with an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. They're looking at you, they're looking at the relationship, and it's almost as if you, by you saying, I've done everything I can do, it's up to you, you're stopping putting forth all the effort to see what they do, okay, to see, or, or to let them know that, hey, you know, I do a lot, and you need to reciprocate, okay, so if you're gener your generous streak in the meta in mid April, your generous streak towards them and towards the relationship, because maybe you kind of felt like you were being walked on a little bit, and you put a stop to that really quickly, Sagittarius. And as soon as you do, it's like, oh, they feel really disconnected. What did I do? I messed up. You're like, hey, it's a hey man, it's all you. We're gonna end this relationship. We're having a fight. No way, I actually really do want to be with you. I love you. Okay. Or just a big fight in a in a in a marriage or a long term bond. Okay, but the point is the end result. At least till I overlay the cards, the end result is clarity and victory. Okay, so you'll feel good about the outcome. Okay, this is gonna be a pretty short reading, Sagittarius, because it's pretty straightforward. Okay, what are the additional messages that you have for Sagittarius? And Sagittarius, you were you your video had a lot of views last month, so something's been going on in your love life that's causing you to question or look for answers or see, you know seek some sort of clarity. And this is saying that it's gonna be okay. 
going to have a good outcome. At least you will feel really good about it. Okay, what are the additional messages for Sagittarius? Wow, right on top of each other. Okay, this fight or breakup was due to somebody, or at least the view that somebody was being sneaky. Okay, lying, conniving person. All right, but it's not over. Okay, your phase with this person isn't over. It may feel like it's over, okay? But you don't really want to go and have a bunch of other options. You're fine with the relationship. You're just done putting work into it for right now, okay? And in essence, that's saving it, okay? Because there's a lot of good here. We have the lover's card and we have the ten of pentacles, okay? There's a lot of good here. There is a connection. It's a strong relationship, Every relationship goes through ups and downs. So this is saying that, you know, it's not over. There may have been some sneaky behavior, or at least so you thought, okay? Or at least misguided information. And, but it's, it's, it's pointing to strength, okay? It's impacting you, okay? I mean, this, look at this. High Priestess reversed and Two of Pentacles reversed. It's like really, you know, there's really a big disconnect there. And there's a question of, should I put more work into it or not? Should I? Shouldn't I? Should I? Shouldn't I? They may be thinking that. Okay? Because there may be some accusations coming from your part. Maybe even valid accusations. And it causes them to say, will they ever forgive me? I don't know. Did I mess up? Crap, I really messed up. <laughs> you know what I mean? And you're just like, hey, figure it out. I don't want to go out and date again. Okay? I'm not, I'm not looking to date again, but you've got to figure this out. That's what you're saying to yourself. <clears throat> and then it's almost as if both of you feel horrible, questioning everything, late nights, spinning, you know. And uh, then it's almost as if you just both really quickly just decide to get over it because then there's happiness and then the moon's reversed. So this means there's not secrets, okay? You think they are are. But there's not, okay? There's no secrecy, all right? There's actually clarity and love, okay, and security. And you both just need to kind of recognize that and realize that, okay? This is beautiful. All right. And then, yes, victory, okay? Back to stability, okay? Now, if you're single, if you're single or newly single, okay, you may be telling yourself, this person was sneaky, I'm sick of it, I'm done, okay, I'm pissed, I'm frustrated, I'm sad, but I felt like there was love, I felt like there was stability, but there wasn't, okay, I want this, I want trust, Okay, I'm clear now on what I want, and I'm going to go get it, and for the time being, I'm going to be completely happy doing my thing. Okay, so if you're single, that could be the message also, but I'm really sensing that there's this fight, miscommunication, but it's not over, you both really love each other, you feel disconnected for like a short minute, and then you realize that everything is fine. 